Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be another decluttering video. I know that I said in my last video that it was my last makeup declutter, but I actually noticed that I have quite a bit more that I can declutter. So I'm actually just going to continue my decluttering series. And today we are going to tackle my eyeshadows, like my single eyeshadows, pigments, um, liners, just everything that has to do with eyes that is not um, like eyeshadow palettes. By the way, I dumped all of this in my blush drawer, which we decluttered last time, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but I want to try and fit everything, which is this and all of this, in this little section right here next to my blushes. So that will be kind of hard to do, but I am pretty sure I am able to do it, so yeah. All right, so let's just get right into it. Um, I'm going to try and pick up the things that I am going to um, get rid of. The first thing I see in here are these, like, what are these, like, colored lenses. I wore them once, they were really cool, but by now they are really old and I just don't want to put old things in my eyes, so I'm going to toss this. All right, so I have a couple of eyeliners right here. I have one by Makeup Geek, this one is um, Essence, and then I also have an Urban Decay one. Um, I think I'm going to get rid of the Essence one because I've had it for a while. Um, Makeup Geek I'm going to put in the maybe pile and then this one as well. I feel like this video is going to be a very long one. Um, this, I have a couple, I think two of these like eyelash cases. Um, I am going to keep them. It is such a waste to throw these away, but they are completely empty. This one has a little house of lashes lash glue. And then this one is also empty, but I think it also has a lash glue in it. Yeah. Then I have a few false lashes in here. These are all by House of Lashes and I think these have been used. So I am going to throw these away. And then I think this is a new pair. Yeah, these are the Iconics, I think. Yeah, so I'm going to keep the new pair. I'm just putting all of that right here for now so that we have a little bit more room to work with. I have all of these limited edition Tarte eyelash curlers, which I am going to keep because this was like a collection that I started a couple of years ago. Um, so I am going to keep these. All right, I have a week on. This is a cream eyeshadow, I think. Let me check. Oh my God. Yeah, it looks like this, but I am going to get rid of this. I never use it and it is quite old. What else? I have a couple of these single eyeshadows that I got from Thailand, I think. Again, I don't use these. I actually rarely reach for like single eyeshadows, so I think most of these I am going to get rid of. I have a couple of these Pupa ones, which... Hmm. This shade is really pretty, but then these two I know I won't wear, so this one I'm going to put in the maybe pile. This blue liquid eyeshadow, really pretty, but honestly, I don't see myself using this, so... That can go to a better home. I have a melted chrome from Essence, which I'm also going to get rid of. Let me see what is underneath here. More single eyeshadows. Okay, I have this from Too Faced, which I think is a bronzer, so that is not in the right um, drawer. I have another Pupa liquid shadow, but as you can see, or like cream shadow, it is completely dried out. Two more of the Essence melted chromes, which I'm going to get rid of. Those were really good, but again, I never, never, ever reach for them. All right, had to take a little break because I got a call, but I am back. I see a couple more eyeliners in here. Um, I think I'm going to keep these three. I think um, I might get some use out of these, so these I'm going to keep. What else do we have in here? This is a MAC Painterly Paint Pot, which honestly, I think is also completely dried out. Let me check. Yeah, I'm going to just toss that as well. Then I have a couple of these Milani eyeshadows, which I'm also just going to get rid of. They are fine. There is nothing wrong with them, but again, I just don't use them like ever. Beautiful shades, but I just don't use them. So I think someone else might get some use out of these. I have a Too Faced Loose Glitter, which I'm also going to just give to someone else. I have this one from Wet n Wild. Um, this is going in the maybe pile, I don't know. Eyeliner by Essence, I'm going to get rid of this. And then I'm also going to get rid of this Melted Chrome. 
All right, then starting off with this container. So I see a couple of these Milani eyeshadows. Again, going to get rid of these. Then I have a couple of ColourPop. Um, this is Dope Dope, my brow color. I'm going to hold on to that. Then I have a Best O like liquid gel liner. But honestly, even when I got it, it was very dried out. So I'm guessing over time it did not get any better. And then I also have a Banging Brunette. Um color for the eyebrows which I'm also going to keep for when I do someone else's makeup I have this B2 eyeshadow which I'm going to get rid of as well as this Kiko pigment loose eyeshadow I'm going to keep my gel liner from Inglot because I really love that and also my cushion liner from Essence the brow from Benefit I'm going to get rid of I did use this quite a bit but I'm going to keep my Colourpop ones because I don't really use these pomades very often. I prefer a powder right now So it doesn't make any sense to keep two um, So I am going to get rid of this one. I have these two from NYX again going to get rid of these This is just very colorful and I don't see myself using them um, anytime soon. So I Have a brow wrist from ABH, which I think I'm going to give to my mom she loves using like pencils for the eyebrows and I don't so I think she might really like this Then I have these two like liquid eyeliners one from Wicon and then one from Catrice I think I'm going to hold on to this one Actually, I'm going to hold on to both. I have a full-size house of products eyelash adhesive I am going to keep this um, and then I have two eyeshadow primers, but honestly, I never use eyeshadow primers anymore. I just use my concealer, so I'm going to get rid of the MAC one and keep the Urban Decay one just in case I do want to use one. I have an extra, I don't know what you call this, for my eyelash curler, so of course I'm going to hang on to it. And then I have a couple of loose like glitters and pigments in here. This one from Makeup Geek I'm going to get rid of. This is just not a color that I would wear very often. Um, and then I have a couple from MAC in here, which I think I might hold on to for now, except for this one, which is more of a rough glitter, and I think I'm going to keep this in my, like, nail uh, drawer, so I'm going to get rid of this, but then all of these I am going to keep. And then I have my Stila liquid shadows, which of course I'm going to keep, you guys know I love these. Um, I am going to get rid of this Primark one, because I did keep the, um week on gold one but i might actually put them all in this little container just upside down like that so i can see the shades come on don't tell me this is not going to fit Ugh. all right so the first container is completely empty moving on to the second container um i do see that there is one more wet and wild eyeshadow which i'm going to get rid of all right, moving on to this little compartment. This is going to be hard because you guys know I love ColourPop. So let's see, I'm going to start here in the front. This used to be such a hype on YouTube, the MAC Uninterrupted shade, but I don't really like it anymore. So this can go. This one, however, I am going to hold on to. I'm just going to put it next to it for now. This one I'm going to get rid of from Annabelle. Giorgio Armani, I do really love this shade, so I might hold on to that. These two macaroon ones, I don't know what to do with these because it is really cute packaging, but I don't really like use these shades ever. Although they are very pretty. Mm. All right, this is going in the maybe pile as well because I really don't know what to do with them. This Urban Decay one used to be such a go-to for me. This is in the shade Easy Baked. Again, this was very hyped on YouTube. Um, I think I might hold on to it. This is such a pretty shade. The color Infallible ones from L'Oreal, mm, maybe pile. This one from Burberry, I am going to keep. This is in the shade number four. This one from NARS. Maybe pal. Another one from NARS. This one I am going to keep. Stila Kitten, of course, I'm going to keep this. This is such a pretty shade. And this has been one of my favorites for years now. Um, and then I have all of these Kiko ones. Let's see. This blue one, that is very original. This one, I think I'm going to get rid of. Ooh, that is very pretty. And then we also have this shade. Ooh, 
I think I'm going to keep all of them except for this one because this is just not something that I would wear. All right, moving on to ColourPop, which is going to be very hard because I really love my Super Shock shadows. This is a True Colors one, which is still good to go. I'm going to get rid of this one, even though it is still good to go. Um, again, I just don't see myself using this shade. I think the limited edition ones on the bottom, I am going to just keep. I have something with limited editions from ColourPop. Don't ask me why. I have like their fourth birthday, their fifth birthday. Um, and I think I even have more. Um, I have these Hello Kitty ones. What else? Disney, this is such a pretty shade. Um, this was their second birthday, I think. And then I have these ones from the holiday collection a couple of years ago. And one of these shades is my absolute favorite. It's actually this one right here in the shade Kush. Wow, this is such a beautiful shade, especially for the holidays. Um, another one from Hello Kitty. This one is from the No Kill LA like dog shelter. Um, let me see. This one is also the dog shelter one. This one as well. Another Hello Kitty one. Um, and then with these, I really don't know what to do with them. This one I'm going to get rid of in the shade Bay. Another Hello Kitty one. Uh, and I think I'm just going to keep all of these. I'm sorry, but I just love them. So I think I'm going to hold on to them. Wow, I did so bad on these ColourPop Super Shocks. Um, I think I got rid of two. That is not good. I need to get rid of some more. But yeah, this is literally everything that I am keeping. This pile right here. So now what I'm going to do is just start organizing it and make it look a little bit more pretty. All right, so this is what it is looking like now that I have rearranged everything. I still think it looks a little bit too cluttered, but we did get rid of a lot. Um, and I still have my maybe, so I'm going to grab those um, so that I can decide what to do with them. These two eyeliners I am definitely going to get rid of. These two from L'Oreal I am also going to pass on to someone because I just never use them and someone else might get more use out of these. This one from NARS I am going to keep, just going to pop it right in here. This one from Wet n Wild I am going to get rid of. And then this last one from Poopa, I'm just going to put it in here. And then I have these two, which honestly I don't know, do they fit there? No. Hmm. I just don't want to get rid of these, but it is already looking so cluttered. I um, might put them in here for now. <laughs> there you go. Right, and that is actually what it is looking like right now. Um, let me show you guys what we got rid of. So this right here is everything that I am throwing away. So it is quite a bit. Um, and I think someone else might really enjoy all of these products. Um, and then this is what the drawer looks like. So on this side, you have my blushes. And then on this side, all of my overflowing like eye products so i am really happy with the progress that i made it is still a little bit much so i might um like rearrange a few things but so far this is what i have going on and that is actually going to wrap up today's declutter if you love binging these videos like i do then i will have my playlist listed down below so that you can just watch all of my decluttering videos um but yeah thank you so much for watching please subscribe if you haven't already i love you so much and i'll see you in the next one bye guys bye.